This is the Bentley EXP 100 GT. It's an electric self-driving concept car that shows Bentley's vision for what its GT cars will look like 35 years from now. And it's also the company's 100th birthday present to itself. So, a few key points to take away before we get into the nitty gritty. This car is designed to be sustainable, high performance and fun to drive. It's all electric, it's autonomous when you want it to be, and it also features some very interesting concepts behind biometrics and artificial intelligence. Before we get into any of that, let's admire the design because it is very striking. It's all lightweight aluminium and carbon fibre, and it's surprisingly large, nearly 6 metres long and 2.4 metres wide, so it's considerably bigger than even a Range Rover. But it disguises its dimensions well because of the sleek proportions and because of the impressive details throughout. Let's talk about the front. The first thing you'll notice is the brand new Flying B mascot, new for Bentley's centenary year. Then of course you have the two circular lights at the front that bleed into this big, enormous, illuminated front grille. This consists of over 6,000 LED lights and it has a couple of purposes. First of all, to greet the driver as they approach the car. And secondly, to warn pedestrians that the car might be being driven in autonomous mode. It also has a third purpose and that is basically to show off. It is like a giant Swarovski window display on wheels. Don't let that big front grille fool you though. This car doesn't use any kind of internal combustion engine. Instead, it uses four separate electric motors, two on the front axle and two on the rear. Together, they produce 1,500 newton meters of torque and 1,400 horsepower. That's good for 0 to 60 in 2.5 seconds and a top speed of 186 miles an hour. In terms of batteries, well, Bentley isn't giving anything away quite yet, but they are saying that any batteries this car uses in the future will be five times more energy dense than anything used in current modern day cars. And that means there's no big weight penalty. The car will only weigh 1,900 kilograms and it will have enough range for 435 miles of range. Plus, you can recharge it to 80% in as little as 15 minutes. We can but dream. In profile, it's very much a Bentley. The famous Bentley haunch, borrowed from the R-Type Continental, that's all present and correct. And then there's the most dramatic thing about this car, the doors. These alone are two meters wide and they pivot outwards and upwards. At the highest point, they're three meters high. At the rear, there are a couple of noteworthy additions. What you want to know about are these rear lights. So you've got really thin light clusters, but on top of that, you've also got 3D OLED displays. These aren't lights, those are actual OLED screens that are able to display almost any pattern to help the car stand out even more. So that's the outside. Let's have a look inside. It's worth saying that the interior looks more like the cockpit of an alien spaceship than a traditional car. But if you look closely, there are a couple of recognizable Bentley traits. There's some familiarity in the shape of the dashboard, for example. And it probably won't come as any surprise to learn that Bentley has lavished the EXP 100 GT with the finest materials. What's most impressive is the way all these materials flow together. The embroidery pattern in the textiles matches the pattern in the leather, and that's also replicated in the wood. The attention to detail and the craftsmanship is exceptional. But we expected that. What we perhaps didn't expect is the use of biometric technology in the seats. We've all heard of heated and cooled seats, right? Well, this does that and goes a step further. It can monitor your body temperature and your posture to cup your buttocks in just the right way to make the ride that little bit more comfortable. The EXP 100 GT can also monitor your eye and head movements and even your blood pressure and uses artificial intelligence to personalize the driving experience. In addition, the car uses an innovative glass canopy embedded with prisms that collect light and transfer it into the cabin using fiber optics. The idea is that it can harvest natural light and then synthesize the light on demand. It can, for example, record the light characteristics of a sunset on any particular journey and then replay the light from this journey in the car. 
allowing you to experience similar light conditions in the car regardless of the time of day. Perhaps more usefully, the glass roof can also be completely transparent or opaque, allowing you to enjoy some sense of open-air motoring or increased privacy. All these settings can be controlled using a series of gestures monitored by the Cumbria Crystal centerpiece. I mentioned earlier that this car is fully autonomous and in autonomous mode, the steering wheel can fully retract, the seats can spin around so you can talk to your fellow passengers and you can even take advantage of the Bentley personal assistant. Think Alexa or Siri, but on steroids and delivering information relevant to what you happen to be looking at at any given moment. And if that isn't crazy enough, then how about this? The car can actually deliver personal goods and services directly to you. There's actually a hatch in the bonnet where your butler or your personal assistant can deliver brand new goods and services direct to the car. And when you're ready to receive them, you can wave a gesture inside the cockpit and have that package delivered directly to the center console whenever you're ready. Bonkers, brilliant. Probably a bit of both. There is so much more to talk about with this car. I could talk about the sustainable materials or the active wheels and tires that can change the tread pattern depending on the weather, on the fly using piezo electric motors. The list goes on and on. But that might all be a waste of time as the majority of these things don't quite yet exist and may never will. But it is great to see Bentley is pushing the envelope, thinking big about the future and who knows, maybe one day cars like this will become a reality. Stranger things have happened.